वेलकम टू और केमिस्ट्री फॉर एवरी वन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू अनलाइज द पॉसिबल वैल्यूज ऑफ एन एल एंड एम एल फॉर द इलेक्ट्रॉन स्विच इज इन द थ्री डी ऑर्बिटल्स अकॉर्डिंग टू क्वांटम मेकैनिक्स ऑर्बिटल्स आर कैरेक्टराइज बाय एन एल एंड एम एल वैल्यूज द डिफरेंट शब सेल्स ऑफ ए शेल आर जनरली डिनोटेड बाय द प्रिंसिपल क्वांटम नंबर ऑफ द शेल फॉलोड बाय द सिंपल ऑफ एन असिमिथल क्वांटम नंबर फॉर एग्जाम्पल टू पी स्टैंड फॉर पी सब of l shell that means second shell before solving the question first let us see the relation between n l and ml values if n is equal to 1 the possible value of l is equal to 0 and possible value of ml is also 0 if n is equal to 2 then the possible value of l is equal to 0 1 and the possible value of ml is equal to 0 minus 1 0 plus 1 That means there is a relation between n, l, and ml. Let us come to the question here. Here the electron is in the 3D orbital, so 3D. So 3 stands for m shell, third shell. So n is equal to 3. There is a relation for n and l. So for for n value, l is equal to 0 to n minus 1. So here n is equal to 3. So three minus one that means two. So one two. So we can write like zero, then one, then two. So l is equal to zero means s orbital. Then for one p orbital and for two d orbitals. So these are the three possible l values. So we want that answer for three d orbital. So for three d orbital l is equal to two. Now let us come to ml for ml it is a magnetic quantum number which is related to l that means azimuthal quantum number so for ml is equal to 2l plus 1 here l for 3d orbitals 2 so 2 into 2 plus 1 that will give 5 so if ml values are 5 then the possible values are 0 plus 1 then here minus 1 Then here plus two. Then here minus two. Count one, two, three, four, five. Five possible values are there. Well, so for three D electrons, n is equal to three, and then l is equal to two, and m l is equal to minus two, minus one, zero, plus one, and plus two. Thanks for watching.